tas in the glass fill with rain. In a really when I sing, wie es klingt by the The Gestapo destroyed the entire stock, and the story of this label was forgotten. Well, there's a record collector in his 70s, and his name is Reiner Lotz. He began traveling around the world to see whether he could find any of these recordings. What you're hearing tonight is a selection of music which survived through that amazing history, music which we learned by listening to the old recordings. opens up the suitcase. This is a story of immigration. About losing relatives and friends. And there is a pile of recordings. This is a drinking song. The song was recorded in the basement of a synagogue. The Zemmer label was one of the few places where Jewish artists were still allowed to be artists. I like to think of it as a Noah's Ark, because it invited artists of all kinds. It's nice to go from a cantorial piece into uh, early, modern, erotic <laughs> poetry. tell you some of the stories about this later, they're, they're really stories that can give you goosebumps. Funny to become emotional. <laughs> Thanks to the perseverance of Rainer Lotz, we have this music again. The whole world has this music again. Yeah.